actually joined by uh, Tracy Donaldson and Catherine Warren coming to us from the Goldburn Museum, which I'm understanding we are in pretty much the oldest establishment here in our area. Is that right? Yeah. Forget about the Byward Market, <laughs> forget about anything like that. This is where everything got started. Yes, Goldburn actually was settled in 1818. Uh, Richmond was first. So we're the oldest mil military settlement in Ottawa, and we predate Bytown, which is kind of cool. That is pretty neat when you think about it. And uh, there's interesting, uh, even the name Stittsville itself has, uh, has some meaning to it. Yep, that's right. Stittsville was named after the first postmaster here, Jackson Stitt, um, and they added the S later. So it used to be Stittville, and now it's Stittsville. Some of the interesting facts that I guess you'll learn at the Goldburn Museum, what is it that you're hoping to do and, and create an atmosphere there? Well, we're really trying to uh, bring the community, get them involved with the history of our township, um, and uh, we have a lot of other things that we're doing too as well. Catherine? Yeah, yeah. Uh, this weekend we've got Spooky Fall Crafts coming up. That's an event for kids who are doing Halloween crafts. Um, October 30th we're making little haunted houses like this one at Mansion Mayhem. Very cool. Um, we've got an art show for adults. We have a knitting circle. We meet once a month and do some knitting at the museum, which is a lot of fun. So, so you like having the outreach programs uh, that are available? Absolutely, yeah. Okay, some of the fun crafts. I guess we got the Halloween theme going over the next little bit. That's right. So these are some of the activities that you'd have the kids coming in and doing? Yeah. All right, what are we doing then? Um, I we'll thought maybe uh, we'd see if you want to make a bat today. I like that. All right. So with, got, yep. with funky eyes, too, I guess, right yeah, here, right? Yeah, we put the eyes on. So basically what you're going to do now is you're going to take your glue stick and you're going to turn it upside down and you just want to put a little bit of glue on one side and you're going to attach the two sides together. And that's <laughs> going to create your back. Is this kid-proof glue? Okay, I got <laughs> it, I got go. it, I got it. Yeah. yeah. And just fold it over a little. That's it. And while you're doing the, yes. the next step, I'll hold that so it dries properly. So the next thing you're going to need to do is you're going to have to cut out these wings here. So all you want to do is just cut kind of a scallop pattern right along the edge of that black. Now I'm getting, now I'm getting testy here. How often will you have programs like this? We have craft days at the museum once a month. Uh, and we've also got a kids club if anyone's interested. It's $5 for the year. And if you come for five visits and bring your card, you get a little prize at the end, which is a lot of fun. Uh, we also have a newsletter for the kids, uh, this one here, where there's activities right. and photos Great. of the kids. So. so, simple now. The next step is more glue. I'm assuming that's where I needed to glue it, right? Yeah, and, okay, yours. Was that about uh, right? That, that's right. Wait, I did that backwards. No worries. <laughs> you know what? It's already a lopsided bag. That's the first thing it's we It's good. Say. Imperfection no is great. Exactly. There's no wrong way of doing this. So you've got your own little bag. See? It's like toothless. <laughs> you guys seen that? How to Train Your Dragon? Okay, we've got that going. Five dollars you were mentioning. Is that's that's Five an unbelievable price? That's that's the wonderful. The craft are actually at three dollars a child too, so they're even cheaper. So. Okay, so that'll uh, head in. And also, you have uh, you were mentioning art. I mean, the art coming in. Yeah. Is it fun to just see constantly different ro the rotation of exhibits coming through? Absolutely. It's great. The art show is nice too because it's all local artists. They're all from Goldburn Township, um, so you get to see what this community has to offer when you come out, which is a lot of fun. Where is the museum actually located? We're actually just south of Stittsville at uh, Stittsville, Maine, at Huntley and Flewellen. Okay. Uh, hours, is it? Uh, uh, one to four, Tuesday to Friday, and Sundays. Okay. Well, congratulations on the programs that you're doing. I like these too, by the way. And good Thanks. luck with that. I think you're going to have a lot of kids coming out and, and wanting much. to get in their spooky houses. It looks wonderful. Uh, and keep that in mind, the Goldburn Museum is something you want to check out, especially for those living in the community wanting to know a little more history as to where it is that they live. We're going to take a short commercial break. We're going to be cooking in just a little bit with the Glen. We've also got uh, an opportunity to check out uh, a really cool store called Urban Tags. And we're going to go a little bridal. Also, this is uh, coming your way in the show. We're back after this. I'm trying.